Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite, and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome into my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family. Just thank you for the love and support, um, being able to receive the messages from the universe, you know, allowing me to be able to pass the message on to you, to give you reassurance that, you know, the things that you are going through right now is going to have a positive outcome in your life. I'm telling myself that as well, because I keep getting the, the uh, that message that even though we're going through some tough times right now, it's going to have a positive outcome. So uh, be patient and, and just keep out, keep on the lookout for the signs. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video. Also, if you are comfortable enough, I would love a chance to hear uh, hear from you. Even um, getting to know me like I'm trying to get to know you. Uh, even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up, tell me about your impact. If and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. And also, if you feel like the videos just gave you good information or even good vibes that you would love to share with a loved one, family, or friend, or even a fellow impact, they're going through some dark times right now. Um, needing confirmation and validation for your life, even their sole purpose, um, or just need to know knowledge going towards their journey, please go ahead and share. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up. I can also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. And thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Uh, for the support and you know I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and today I'm listening to uh, my meditation music let me turn it up just a little bit more uh, erase all negative energy mental blockages while you sleep deep meditation positive energy meditation and I will post that link in the description box below and today my video <laughs> is about twin flame one and hey oh goodness it's hard to stay happy and positive through a dark situation. But stay true to stay true to self and trust the process. Ooh, I'm going through that today. I didn't think I was gonna do any videos today, y'all. But you know, I said when you guys don't get off your chest, you know, like I tell y'all, my videos are my uh, my therapeutic outlet. And being able to be blessed to be able to tell somebody about you know these different things that are going on. So many people are starting, you know, that always relate to me. And I know we're all going through some trying times. And, you know, you're trying to keep your head above water. Um, you know, you keep hearing universe. You know, you, you have your loved ones this past, you know, letting you know, you know, we're here. Um, be patient. Have faith. Uh, trust. Believe, you know, in the process. Allow yourself to go through the process. You know, like I said, uh, this, the video right before this, you know, is giving birth to a new life so it's just like if you're you're a parent and you have had children you know what stages you do when you're pregnant you know you go through the hormones mother earth's hormones is when we had all those natural nat uh, natural disasters you know going through all those different things that you know she's going through that birthing cycle so it's like we're going through all these different things and you know you know they send you signs like if you look at your numbers and um they're telling you to be patient, you know, step back and look at things from a, you know, a different perspective or check out the, you know, the bigger picture where more answers will start coming clearer to you when you're getting closer to your journey. You know, when you know you're close to stuff, it seems like everything starts to get, get to you. You know, you don't know what blessings are coming in for you. You don't know what, what's going on for you, but you know, something's about to change, but it's like, it seems like when you know you're on the brink of something, it seems like that's when you can it all type of ways so it's just like we always have to you know trust the process you know that God and universe got things going on for us we don't know because it's working behind the scenes um but this is that time for you to you know I have to stay focused like I have to tell myself stay focused on the you know making videos stay focused on trying to be happy you know even though it, I mean there's things that'll be going on in your life like things will be just getting snatched up, snatched up, and it's just like, how the heck am I gonna stay happy and positive with all this stuff going on? You know, the devil stay busy. He really do. And like you're in that low frequency, and you're in that negative vibe. You're angry, you're pissed. You know, you're ready to clap back, probably punch somebody in their dad on face because you're going through so much because you want people to feel what you're going through, or not even, you know, you want somebody to understand or put 
you know, meaning behind the frustrations you're dealing with. You know, some people are like, I want people to feel what I feel, but that's not good. But, you know, there's there's so many different things that's going on in life. And it's like, we have to really look at everything we're going through. And it's just like, it makes you feel like you're not doing enough, which you are. You are. It's just like we're going through this push and pull uh, situation. It'll make you feel like you straight schizo. Because it's like, I can be really happy and goofy one minute. And it's just like, things are, you know, occurring around me, or it's just like, you know, I was all good until I see, like, Mother's Day stuff, and I'm just like, you know what, I don't, I'm tired of hearing about Mother's Day, and, you know, these commercials, like, Dear Mama, I don't want to hear all that stuff, I said, my mom, I said, I don't know my mom, I haven't connected with my mom, and my other mom's dead, so I'm just like, this ain't nothing for me, <laughs> you know, and then my birthday's right after that, so I'm just like, ugh, that's like a thorn in my side, so it's just like, all these different things are going on, I try not to con concentrate on that but it's just like Rosalind just use it as a milestone you know I know you don't you don't understand what's going on but we I have to trust that process I gotta trust it everything's gonna be all right just allowing yourself to just go through these motions you know I had a good cry today you know I was just going through different things and you know just wanting things to be better you know going through all those different things that you're going through and you know hearing the universe talk about we're proud of you we we understand that you're tired. Yeah, you can be mentally and emotionally tired. You like you're tired of going through this stuff. You are, when you're being strong and strong is all you got. I mean, sometimes it would make you run on fuel. Like, what else? I mean, God, dog, <laughs> when is this gonna be over? So it's just like going through all these different things. It seems like Mother Mother Earth going through Braxton Hicks right now because it seems like everybody getting hit the long way. So it's just like when we're going through those things. You know, I said I'm gonna meditate. And I started meditating and it, you know, it felt like heaviness is coming off of me. And it's just like, you know, I get frustrated because I shouldn't allow myself to switch over like that. But it's just like, I guess it's just recycling, recycling energy that's going on. And I'm just like, okay, you know, I get it. I understand. So, cause it was just, I told y'all today, I was not going to make any videos cause I've been making them like this is my fourth day going back to back. And I said I was just gonna get some rest today, but it's just like you know they you know they tell me you know I've been wanting to get up, but I had to lay down for a while, you know head was hurting and all that stuff. So I said I just want to make sure I'm in a better vibe before I start uh, making videos because I haven't even you know replied to anybody's comments, and that's the main reason why I didn't apply to anybody's comments because of the energy I had going on right now. So I did not want to you know purge that out to somebody else you know i want to purge out loving energy positive energy all these different things but not negative energy so we're going through all these things but you have to be able to trust the process and i keep on hearing that rosalind just trust the process we're all it is not just me going through it it's just like it seems like everybody i'm talking to you know are having these hiccups that's going on in their life you know if you lost a parent you know especially if it's like you know mother's day and stuff like that and you're missing your mom you know that that's one thing that's already a thorn in your side and it's just like the the situations you got personally going on that you're really trying to aim towards it just seems like you know you don't know where it's at it's in a standstill you don't know what's going on but you know something's going on so it's just like you have to be patient really step aside you know i said i had to step aside and without adding emotion to it and just really look it's like you're clearing a lot of stuff and yeah it can be hard at times so don't be hard on yourself i have to tell myself don't be hard on yourself because you feel this right this way you have every right to feel this way but it ain't no need for you to stay in that kind of vibe it is not going to be healthy for you to say at a low frequency so it's just pushing out these videos it's like therapeutic for me so it's just like, I know a lot of people going through the same thing I'm going through because it's just like, you can be okay for a few days and then next thing you know, it doesn't take, it, it's just like one little thought or one little memory or something like that. It, it can really take you back. You know, sometimes it feel like you don't went 10 spaces up and you're happy and next thing you know, one little negative trigger puts you like three paces back and then you get frustrated like, dang, I was doing good a couple of days ago and then I have this little brinky dink thing that's coming on and then, you know, ego want to come add their little two cents in like you know oh this and this snap i'm like look uh-uh we ain't about to go through that today <laughs> we are not about to go through that today. so it's just like having to ignore my ego because i already am dead and hurt but it's just like you know when you know you got something going on for you 
devil will be trying to trying to pick up everything that he knows that can attack you in that way to take you right back where he wants you to be. You know, devil and darkness want you to stay at a low frequency. They want you to stay in that mad, irritating vibe, like where you're lashing out on people, you know, taking everything personal that people do to you, all these different things. So it's just like, you know, like I, I did earlier, you know, before I start doing my videos, just uh, meditate, you know, because that's why I put this erase uh, all negative energy because now it's like, like it felt like it was still a little bit there right before I did my videos but now it's just like I can breathe now because it just felt like a heaviness on my chest because I was dealing with so much but now I'm just like you know what you're gonna be all right you're gonna be all right <laughs> you just you lashed out and said what you had to say you know and deal with it as it comes but you have to be able to trust the process so why are you going through the things that you're going through? It might seem unfair. It might seem irritating. And you know, you're tired of running that race, you know, from the dark side. You're tired of running that race. We've been there for far too long. And trust the process. It's going to be over soon. I don't know how things going to pop off or whatever. But you're going to have lessons that are going to come to you. And nobody's going to be able to stop them. So, you know, keep praying up. Just keep the trust in the process. Believe that things will come for you. It's like, just like I deserve mine, you deserve yours too. So it's just like, just take a, a breather, you know, if you need to. If you need to relax, go ahead and relax. I said, I'm going to probably do about three or four videos today and I'm going to call it a day, you know, because I, you know, they told me I can rest up today, but it was just like, I felt therapeutic, uh, going through therapeutic therapy today. So I said, I'm okay, I'm going to go ahead and make some videos. So, you know, just trust and believe. I know it's hard to be happy and stay positive through so many daggone trying to you know situations that you're going through especially if you're getting hit from so many different directions that can that can leave somebody overwhelmed so they understand that and they, you know when you start talking to the universe and letting them know you know i had to call on archangel michael just to calm my nerves so you know going through all those different things and knowing better days are coming for you just pay attention to the signs and just trust the process so I hope that was uh, you were able to resonate with that. Please drop me a line and let me know um, how you feel about that or you feel like you're going through the same thing. Um, I'm going to give my post notification shout out to, uh, let me see, Jesse. Much love to you as well. Uh, I'm at 77. So much love to y'all. I hope y'all have a blessed day. You know, this week is almost over with. And I think that's the reason why I'm tired too, because it's like towards the end of the week. And I've really been, you know, working hard on these videos. So like and subscribe. Drop me a line. I would love a chance to hear from you and, you know, hear your feedback. Uh, dr drop me a line. Thumbs up. Like and even share. And hit the notification bell and subscribe. And I will talk to you later. Know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, forever loved, and knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days. And send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can because your positivity and your loving vibes can really take somebody a very long way. So I'll see you on my next video. Much love, peace, and be wild.